Ah, you know what that sound means. We're heading to a rarely visited corner of the book nook, and that is the fan fiction corner. Lucky, are you excited to hear what the fans have cooked up for us this week? Mac, last time it was about Riddick falling in love with a spaceship, so you bet your bottom dollar I'm excited. <laughs> okay, I searched the internet high and low. There is uh, not yet, there is not yet any Riddick selection fan fiction crossover, Disappointing. unfortunately. Disappointing. Um, they're still working on it. So I've, I've combed the depths and found two good ones. Um, the other fan fiction I found is called fire and ice overall. Um, and then it's, it's multi-part. I'll just, I'll read you uh, this one. I'll read you the description. High rulers of the galactic empire, Han and Leia Organa Solo oh, no. are at their wits end with their spoiled son, Ben. <laughs> oh no. After he sends the last of their marriage prospects packing, they decide to take drastic measures. They decide to hold a selection. <laughs> Neville Longbottom living on Coruscant. No, no, no. no. 35 girls from surrounding planets will all come to live in the castle and compete for Ben's hand in marriage. With the First Order rising from the ashes of the Empire, it Whoa. may be the pick-me-up that the people need. Wait. But that doesn't mean Ben has to be happy about it. Prepare for craziness, drama, and a whole lot of Ben Solo sassiness. Mm. But. So Great description. So none of the Star Wars canon matters then. I don't. I'm not trying to nerd out here, but like, uh, what the First Order and Han and I, 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 what? <laughs> and then none of the selection matters either because it says you don't have to know what the selection is to read this fan fiction. Then what's the point, author Squishy Twenty Eight? You're awesome. You killed it. You did exactly what you're supposed to do. Uh, this is Oliver Nothing on. Uh, I found it on Archive of Our Own. Oh. This is ongoing. The most recent uh, installment was came out in June, June 23rd. So oh. it's not done yet. I just want to read you some of the tags. Um, the, this this website has tags. Um, oh, this good. is what the author used to describe it. Um, graphic depictions of violence. Oh. Star Wars. The Bachelor on Steroids. Slow Burn. Hate hmm. to Love. Prince Ben Solo. Ben Solo is a mess. Ray doesn't <laughs> want to be here. Neither does Ben. Poe and Ben are brothers. What? Good parent Han Solo. Han and Leia work out. What? I wrote this instead of sleeping. I will go down with this ship. Alternate universe. Oh my God. <laughs> Alternate universe. Canon divergence. No kidding. <laughs> is this a kissing book? Question mark. I don't know what that tag means. <laughs> this might be the first in a series, but who knows? The first couple chapters are short. It gets better. I promise. Oh. A little self-defeating there, huh? <laughs> but it's a very good description of what happens. Wow. Uh, a very good description of maybe what to expect. Um, I did not read all of this. It's about, it's 45,000 words Jesus. long. So it's its own little novella there. Um, but I did find a couple of lines here. It was Leia herself who finally said the dreaded word. So is that our final decision? Bringing back the selection for our son? So the selection has wow. existed in this world for a long time. It's gone away. And they're going to bring it back for uh, Ben Solo. Maybe that's Wait. why he sort of went off the deep end and uh, spoilers killed. Uh, so then this would be the third time the selection has come back that we are reading because Star Wars takes place in a galaxy far, far away a long time Whoa. ago. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and the selection takes place in our in our future. In our future, right, because that's World War Four, post that. Maybe that's where they maybe that's where they got it from. It was from the stars. 